Alright, drop a hop to it. Alright, baby. Another hop to it. Jesus, this is just disgusting. Yikes, yiker, dude. That's mega damage. Mm, 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 mm. It's your boy Busy back at it again, and today we'll be playing a little MTG Arena. More specifically, we're going to be playing Standard, and we're going to be running some green, white rabbits. Let's go ahead and look over the list. Let's go. The deck is pretty straightforward. You're basically just going to be slamming lands, throwing down rabbits. A couple cards to note um, for interaction. You know, you can turn one seasoned Warren Guard into a turn two carrot cake, giving you a token, um, allowing the Warren Guard to get plus two plus O oh when it attacks, which is just a pretty nice little aggressive move from the rabbits. Paw Patch Recruit, I find it's better to wait and throw this card down on turn three uh, versus turn one. But if you got it in your hand, you got maybe two in your hand, this card is exceptional. Carrot Cake, super great in this deck. Uh, Valley Quest Caller is probably one of the strongest cards. You know, the two mana, two, three. Uh, whenever one or more rabbits you control enters, you get to scry one. The card does give other rabbits we control plus one, plus one. Just absolutely brutal. Bro Guard Mentor, another amazing card. Uh, just green, white here for a star, star trample. And his power and toughness are each equal to the number of creatures you control. Um, obviously, Phineas Ace Archer here is just exceptional. Two mana, two, two, Vigilance, Reach. And whenever Phineas attacks, put a plus one, plus one counter on each other creature you control that's a token or a rabbit then if creatures you control have total power 10 or greater draw a card this card is super pushed harvest right host three mana three three whenever harvest right enters or another rabbit enters um target creature gets plus one plus oh until end of turn then draw a card if this is the second time this ability has triggered lastly for our creatures warren war leader a four mana four four with offspring two um i rarely ever use the offspring because by the time you can throw warren down uh, its ability is just so good it wins the game. Warren Warleader says whenever you attack, choose one. Create a 1-1 one, one white rabbit creature token that's tapped and attacking, or attacking creatures you control get plus one plus one until end of turn. Uh, that's pretty much the one I pick all the time and it just wins me the game. I've never made a 1-1 one, one white rabbit, I've never really seen the need to, but uh, maybe if you're behind on creatures or you just need to get that board state back after maybe like a board wipe, you know the 1-1 one, one tokens are not bad. Sick form, what is good, my dude? Sick form, how's it going? All right, this is a really strange hand. Um, it's kind of too many lands, but we can really just hope we draw into something. Um, Razor Verge, Thicket, hello, the opponent. Go ahead and get down a paw patch, recruit a beautiful little paw patch. Mm -hmm. Let's go, let's go, baby. Okay, six. Oh, sick form going, gonna kill my boy. Is he gonna kill my boy? All right, Brogard Mentor. I think he's gonna target my paw patch and murder it. I mean, not murder, but you know, he's gonna put it to the the graveyard. He's gonna bury our paw patch recruit. Mm -mm -mm. Cut it down, bye. <clears throat> okay, so we're stuck with a 1-1 one, one here. Ouch. Alright, he smacks me. Brushland into a paw patch recruit and offspring. Okay, we swing for three. Beautiful. What's it going to be? Sick form. Okay, his lands are coming in tapped. That is really unfortunate for him. Hop to it here. Create three 1-1 one, one white rabbits. Let's go. Oh my god, he counters my thing. Fine by me. We still get six damage in. Okay, a 2-4. We'll name rabbits here and hop to it. Hmm, we'll swing for six. Opponent is down to just five. K 
can he recover? So, Lane comes in tap, not bad. He, he is doing double damage. If I would lose life, I lose double that life. Ouch. Okay. Oh, so he's playing a, a fairy deck. Okay, I see you. I see you. A little dimmer control. Harvest right host. And he can't counter it. <clears throat> It'd almost be smarter to just drop it on our on our mentor. It does have trample. Sure. So he takes six immediately. Okay, sure. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, the trample damage. Ouch. I'm sorry, dude. Mm. Ouch. Yeah, yeah, beautiful stuff. Oh, rank up. Elevab, what is good? Okay, opponent goes first. Oh man, we're stuck with no planes. Yikes. Now we can hope to draw one. The hand isn't really that great though. There's no turn one, so. I think I have to mulligan. Okay, that's fine. I think we just get rid of a hop to it here. Hello, the opponent. What's it gonna be, partner? Hey, what do I got? A little firefly, dude? A little freaking bug? Damn, dude, that's crazy. It's crazy. Hold on one second, there, guy. Yeah, everything looks fine. Ravine Raider, that is nice. That is a nice card. All right, baby, let's go, Elevab. Okay, is he gonna pump? Please pump. Yes, I'd rather him pump his creature because that means he's does he's not gonna cast anything else. So, all right, Paul Patch recruit. Valley Quest Caller here is the play. The opponent can kill it though. That is unfortunate. That is definitely unfortunate. <clears throat> Greedy Freebooter. Oh, he's going to kill the Valley Quest Caller. No, he's not, but he is going to get me for two damage. Okay. Play a land. Go ahead and paw patch uh, with the recruit. Sorry, with the offspring. We do not need a land. We do not need a hop to it. We already have two in the hand. Go ahead and swing for two. Opponent's of course gonna block. Get his scry, get his treasure. It's gonna be a tough, tough match here. Um, we really need some removal. I think he's gonna play some, uh, like a shieldred. Let's hope not. It does look like he's in mono black though, so I could see I could see Shieldred. Evolving Wilds. Okay, okay. Ah, for a mountain. Will you stop throwing that bug around? Okay, got the charger. Offspring, cool, cool. Hmm, Cavern of Souls. We can Cavern of Souls rabbit here. Um, I kind of like the Valley Quest Caller actually here. Ooh, Phineas Ace Archer, yes. I love Phineas. He's my ace. 
All right, now we just swing with the whole team. Hold gonna do some gang blocking, I'm sure. No. Just takes the damage. Laughing Jasper Flint, okay. Now he's gonna swing. Sure. What is this guy doing? Go ahead and pop Phineas. Scry that land at the bottom. Good game, dude. Good game. Beautiful. Grace Skull, what is good, my dude? Alright, um, we go first. Uh, this is keepable. I have no choice. It's a really good hand. We'll go ahead and name rabbits here. Hello, that opponent. Drop down the paw patch recruit. No offspring. He 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 has no offspring. He's alone out here. Okay, his land comes in what tapped? Lupin Flower Village into a Valley Quest caller. Swing for three. Ouch. Okay. A plains. Okay, okay, okay. A Valley Quest Caller. Oh shit. Oak Hollow Village. Into a Harvest Ride Host. Give the Valley Quest Caller. Um, Carrot Cake we don't really want as much right now. And we'll swing with both of our boys. If he blocks, you know, we trade. Oof. Opponent down to 12. And we have our own Harvest Rite host down. Sorry, our own Valley Quest caller down, so... We're pretty much equals here. We're basically playing the same deck. I'm just... Mine's a little more pushed. You know, I've got uh, the better lands, it looks like. Valley Quest Caller. That's a good card. That is a good card. Okay. We can't underestimate the opponent. Interesting. Okay, so another... Our own Valley Quest Caller. Um, yeah, make ours a 4 4. We get the scry. Put that land on the bottom. Basically, just swing with the freaking team here. He's got to start blocking here. I mean, we have lethal damage. What's that, 13? He blocks two, he takes what, five, or he blocks here, he takes eight. What, what, what are you gonna do? Make up your mind, Grayskull. Okay. S weird trade. I mean, he did it. He, ki he killed my Paw Patch recruit, but he he didn't have to block that way. Ouch. Now that's a good card. Nice. Maybe we could change out our stuff and add this. Oof. He hit us with the stuff, guys. He hit us. I will right, we'll go ahead here. I'd have to sacrifice that. Mm. Let's, let's lush portico. Put the brush lint on the bottom of the battle for you, baby. Go ahead and harvest right host. Yes, there's my war and war leader. E either way, we're going to swing for three. Opponent must block. And we survive. We survive. OK, 
Okay. Drew to the spade. The fuck. All right. Throw down the war and war leader. Hop to it next. Sure. Go ahead and swing for lethal. Create a, a rabbit that's also attacking. Good game, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. Hmm. Russell, guys, what is good, Russell? Okay, we go first. Um, pretty solid hand. Hmm, lush portico. Okay, interesting. Um, we can keep this. Go ahead and hello the opponent. Seasons Warrengard. Thornwood Falls comes in tapped. Go ahead here and... Yeah, let's get down Carrot Cake here. We do get the Scry as well, and we don't need any more lands. Our opponent's down to 18. Two lands. We'll name rabbits here. Get down the Valley Quest Caller, of course. Each opponent gets a poison counter. Oof. Alright, we'll swing for uh, six damage here. Opponent's down to 12. What was he going to be, partner? Yeah, he was going to try to counter our thing, but... Oopsie. Ah, venerated Rot Priest. Pretty good. We'll Lush Portico here. I don't really want the Mentor at this point. Let's go ahead and sacrifice the cake. We do gain three life. Um, Scry want another... Burrowguard Mentor, a land. Right, we can go ahead and attack with the squad. What's he going to be, partner? He's not going to block, of course. He wants to try to get that poison in. <clears throat> Will it be enough? Fabled Passage, okay. So he does get four lands here. It does come in untapped. Very nice. Will it be enough? <laughs> Good game. Good game. Mm -mm -mm. What is good, my dude? Opponent goes first. We got two lands. <sighs> Opponent goes first. Hmm. We can turn one Lush Portico into a turn two Quest Caller. Turn three, we hop to it, or we Carrot Cake. Granted, we find the lands. Um, yeah, we'll Lush Portico here. Paw Patch Recruit is a pretty good card. Gonna need more planes if we're ever gonna play the war and war leader. All right, let's get down a forest. Get down the valley quest caller. Doesn't look like the opponent's gonna have any answers for the quest caller. Hmm. Okay. Search for a basic land, put it onto the battlefield, tapped. <clears throat> Pretty good. Okay, we did get that planes we were looking for. Go ahead here and paw patch uh, recruit with the offspring as well. We don't need a hop to it. Harvest Trade Host is good. 
Only two damage to the opponent. Um, I'd like some removal as well. Okay, his hidden nursery comes in tapped. Scrap shooter, Ikes. Um. Go ahead and get down the war and war leader here. Well, let me think. Yeah, I like the war and war leader. We don't need the land. Will he block? He takes four. That's not bad. Yeah, I didn't want to lose my valley quest caller. That's the deal. If we attack with the quest caller, it's... Oof, you know? Okay, he does gain three life. He does search for lands. Another heaped harvest. Okay, we draw a land. I was not looking for a land. We'll play Harvest Right Host. Give um, the little booger head. Mm -hmm. Carrot cake as well. We do not need a lush portico. Give a uh, paw patch recruit plus one as well. Alright, go ahead and swing with three creatures. Um, we could create a 1-1. One, one. Let me see the battlefield. Attacking creatures get plus one, plus one. So he's going to block. Okay, sure, we trade. He does lose a bit of life from trample damage. What is it going to be? He's got seven mana. I mean, he can definitely... Oh, yeah, that's a good car. Okay, let's go ahead and hop to it. Make sure everything gets bigger. Valley Quest Caller, not bad for the top. Go ahead and throw down the Valley Quest Caller. Scry. Uh, we just have to attack with everything here. Attacking creatures get plus one, plus one. Ouch! I'm so sorry, dude. Good game. Hmm. Good stuff. Youch. Let's go. Poi, what is good? We go first. Um, it's not really a great hand, but we will keep. Get down the Razor Verge Thicket. Hit the opponent with a hello. Sun Shower Druid, a 1-3. Brushlands, Caver, oh sorry, Care Cake. Phineas, Ace Archer, he's alright, he's alright. No blocks here. Okay, rabbits. Harvest right. Make our rabbit big and attack. Opponent is down to 19. Yeah, I should have got the Phineas out. Um, but I just really wanted to have a little bit of defensive maneuverability here. Okay. Ooh, that's a good card. <laughs> Add one mana. Okay. Put a land in the hand. At least he didn't fight with it. 
He could have fought our creatures. Um, rabbit. Okay, burrow guard mentor. Phineas, ace, archer, let's go. We'll attack with both of these bad boys. Ooh, maximum damage. Okay. What do you got for us? Yeah, that's a good car. Okay, we can hop to it. Sure. Um, let's get another Burrow Guard mentor down as well. I think we're going to have to sacrifice Phineas, dude. We're going to have to sacrifice Phineas. I love you, Phineas, but... Yeah, I needed to get that plus one, plus one counter on everything. Sure, sure. Good game. Yeah, uh, Poi, I don't know, he's got that stuff going on over there. Phineas, he did his job. Poor guy. Poor guy. Yeah, yeah, beautiful stuff. Okay. Everything gets some plus one, plus ones. Sure. All right, we'll take eight. All right, drop a hop to it. All right, baby. Another hop to it. Jesus, this is just disgusting. Yikes, yiker, dude. That's mega damage. Mm, 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 mm. Negative 42. Ouch. Ouch. I know I went a little hard. I didn't, I didn't really have to slam him that hard, but you know. I wanted to showcase what these rabbits are capable of. Absolutely beautiful stuff here today. These green white rabbits, they came and they absolutely did work. Uh, standard rank is really no match for these rabbits. Yeah, I'd give it an, uh, an A plus overall. The deck is really good. If you have the wild cards, I would definitely say craft this deck. It's extremely fun, super potent. I will leave my Patreon on screen and down in the description below. Feel free to support the channel any way you like. There are multiple tier lists for you guys to check out. Um, if you enjoy the content, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that little bell to be notified for future videos, and stick around on the channel with some of these fine videos here, and I'll see you next time. Peace.